Hi, I'm David Kramer with Vontu Learning Network. Welcome to another episode in my series of videos where I address a concept within each of the chapters of Bixie's 13th edition TDMM. This week, we'll be looking at Chapter 6, ITS Cables and Connecting Hardware, and talking about the classification of cables by their construction type. If you've worked in this industry for a while, you know that there are a large number of cable designs used, and each one has its own unique designation and acronym. Both ISO IEC and ANSI TIA have their own ways of describing cables. But in my opinion, ISO IEC has a far better method. ISO IEC 11801 uses an XY designation, where X is the overall screen type and Y is the individual pair screen type. Table 6.3 in your TDMM describes these designations. You can see from the table that the designations are very intuitive. X, the first designator, can be a U for no screen, F for overall foil screen, an S for overall braid screen, or an SF for an overall foil and braid screen. The second designator, Y, can either be a U for no screen or an F for individual foil screens. Take, for example, a U slash UTP cable. The first U would indicate no overall screen, and the U after the slash would indicate no individual screens. Or take an S slash FTP cable, where the S indicates an overall braid screen, and the F indicates individual foil screens. But when it comes to ANSI TIA, there are no clear design designations. Mostly, you'll see UTP for unshielded twisted pair, and SCTP for screen twisted pair. You can refer to Table 6.4 in your TDMM for a comparison of the naming standards between the two organizations. Now for this week's question, I'm asking, when applying designations to connecting hardware, how should they be referenced? Should it be A, UTP or STP? B, screened or unscreened? C, FTP, or D, all of the above? If you don't know, I'll give you the answer next week. And the answer to last week's question is A, there are no specific limitations. You can find that chapter 5, page 42 in your TDMM. Or could there be more than one correct answer? Let me know your thoughts on this. To learn more about both our live and online RCDD and OSP review courses, or our upcoming outside plant design series, contact me at davidc at vontulearningnetwork.com, at my office at 813-321-5533, or visit our website at vontulearningnetwork.com. So join me again next week for another chapter from the TDMM. And thanks for watching.